Welcome to video 3.4, Department for Education Guidance, from the Leadership Toolkit in the Safe and Effective Use of AI in Education online resources. To support you and make sure you're following best practice, the Department for Education has produced a policy paper, Generative AI in Education. It states that if used safely, effectively, and with the right infrastructure in place, AI can support every child and young person, regardless of their background, to achieve at school and college, and develop the knowledge and skills they need for life. It acknowledges the potential of AI tools to enhance teaching and learning by reducing administrative burdens and providing tailored support. However, it also emphasises the need for safe, responsible and effective implementation, highlighting the imperative to address risks such as inaccuracy, bias and intellectual property infringement. The Department for Education has also produced the guidance Generative AI Product Safety Expectations. These guidelines are primarily aimed at edtech developers and suppliers, but as a leader, you also need to understand them to ensure that the AI tools used in your setting are safe and effective. Remember, it's your responsibility to ensure that any AI tool introduced in your setting are appropriate, safe, and have the correct safeguards, including those to protect personal data. Education settings need to ensure that the infrastructure is in place to support the use of AI systems and other digital tools. To do this, you can review your position against the Department for Education's digital and technology standards in schools and colleges. These include standards on cyber security, filtering and monitoring, and digital leadership and governance. This guidance highlights that good digital technology governance identifies roles and responsibilities, establishes critical processes to manage digital technology, and ensures that up-to-date information on the school or college's digital technology is available to support decision making. To support schools and colleges in meeting the digital and technology standards, the DfE have produced a service called Plan Technology for Your School. Designed in collaboration with senior educational leaders, the service helps schools and colleges make strategic decisions about technology procurement and implementation. You can use this service to assess your current technology setup against the DfE Digital Technology Standards, and you will also receive actionable recommendations on how to meet these standards. Schools and colleges must have systems to block harmful or inappropriate online content and to monitor online activity for safety concerns such as bullying. These systems should be reviewed every year to stay up to date. A senior leader should be responsible for digital technology, making sure it supports school priorities and meets the needs of staff and students. Keeping records of digital equipment and planning for emergencies helps ensure smooth running. Having a clear strategy reviewed annually supports safe, effective use of technology, including AI. To summarise, the Department for Education's guidance on digital leadership and governance standards outlines essential practices for schools and colleges to effectively manage digital technology and can help to get started with creating a digital strategy. If you don't have one already, key recommendations include assigning a senior leadership team, SLT member for digital technology, maintaining up-to-date registers, incorporating digital technology in disaster recovery plans, and developing a digital technology strategy. As with any new initiative in schools and colleges, it's important to consider your strategic priorities and see what opportunities there are to align the use of AI and digital tools with your development planning. For example, if one of your priorities for development is to make better use of data to reduce the attainment gap, or you have a priority to use formative assessment to improve progress, you can explore how AI can support you in achieving this safely. Alignment with these wider priorities helps with implementation, as staff will see the immediate benefits. It's important to always remember that while AI systems can support your work, you must always maintain human oversight and not outsource your thinking or decision-making to AI. Human interaction remains at the core of education.